Hey, welcome back to my kitchen. Okay, my husband came up with this great idea. Since we had all this basil in our uh, garden, he decided today, let's clean up the basil and let's make some pesto. <laughs> so, I find myself making pesto sauce today. Anyways, it's easy to put together, actually. Uh, garlic, pine nuts, uh, some Parmesan cheese, freshly grated Parmesan cheese, and of course, the basil, all washed and ready to go. So oil. we're just going... Oil, oil too, no? Oh, yes, yes, oil. We're going to need lots of, well, not lots, but probably about a cup half a cup to a cup of oil. So what we're gonna do is, first of all, we're going to blend the garlic and the pine nuts. So I'm putting in two nice tablespoons of garlic. Actually, you know what, because I'm making a lot. I'm gonna put three tablespoons of garlic okay and this is about half a cup of pine nuts let me tell you something these pine nuts are very expensive they're like a, a ten dollars for a hundred grams so take care of them preserve them <laughs> Okay, we're going to use all of this up. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you guys all know my husband? I didn't know you were, the phone was there. He's the one that comes up with all these great ideas. But, uh, okay, I can't say he didn't help because he actually did most of the work. He, he grated all the cheese for me. He went to pick and washed all the uh, the basil. Okay. Nice. Okay, I need to add a little bit of oil to this. Okay. And you're going to need a jar. A jar? A jar to put this in. Yeah. Oh, is that ever nice and creamy? Look at that. Nice and creamy. Just that smells amazing already. I don't need to even add anything else. <laughs> so now we're gonna add a little bit at a time of the basil already washed. Maybe I have to use the other, I'm using the, the Nutra bullet, but maybe I needed to use the other, uh, the other grinding machine that I have. Probably would work out better. I feeling I have a feeling it would work out better with the other machine. Oh, yeah. yeah, I need the other machine. Okay. 
Let's try this. And another spoon. So I don't I don't I think we need to put some of more oil in here now. Okay. So I'm gonna need like a half a cup, but I can't it won't all fit in this at one time. Okay, let me see. use like a, a little bit of this. What are you using? Other leaves? Yeah, I put the leaves with the, all that uh, pine nut and garlic. Okay, I, this I know. Okay, so now I can't mix. I can't mix it in that. I'm gonna oh, just unless... do the leaves and then we'll mix it all together. Okay. You got to take half of this and put it in a jar, and then we'll grind up the other stuff in here, and then mix it together. Good about this. Okay, so we're nearly done making the pesto. Look at that. Just beautiful. The only thing, the only thing is I have a small blender machine thing. So I can only do a little bit at a time. You know what? My next, my next thing that I'm going to buy is a nice food processor. Yes, don't laugh. No, I'm laughing because that's how you got the, uh, the <laughs> other thing. <laughs> okay, that's it. We're done processing. <laughs> Look at that. Now, can you just it's mix it all up? And 
just add, uh, we might have to add a little bit of salt. Actually, for me, I like it like that. And that's it. Now we're going to take this and we're going to put it in the jars. I'll show you the, or my husband will show you the jar. And that's it. And we're going to have pesto pasta and pesto chicken. Oh, they say it's good on seafood too. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, you want to make the salmon. Salmon. Oh. Salmon, salmon. I keep on calling it salmon, but the L is uh, is uh, silent. Okay, folks, that's it. Simple. See you later. Bye bye.